A canyon-like hole in the sun's atmosphere has opened up and may launch a high-speed stream of solar wind into Earth's magnetic field. The Coronal Hole is a gigantic solar gulf stretching across the sun's center. Coronal holes are areas in the sun's upper atmosphere where our star's electrified gas is less hot and dense than in other regions, which makes them appear black in contrast. Around these holes, the sun's magnetic field lines, instead of looping back in on themselves, point outward into space, beaming solar material outwards at up to 2.9 million kilometers per hour. This barrage of energetic solar debris, mostly consisting of electrons, protons and alpha particles, is absorbed by Earth's magnetic field, which becomes compressed, triggering a geomagnetic storm. The solar particles zip through the atmosphere near the poles where Earth's protective magnetosphere is weakest and agitate oxygen and nitrogen molecules, causing them to release energy in the form of light to form colorful auroras such as the northern lights. Predicted to be a G1 geomagnetic storm, it could cause fluctuations in power grids and impair some satellite functions, including those for mobile devices and GPS systems. It could also cause an aurora to appear as far south as Michigan and Maine. Geomagnetic storms can also come from two other forms of solar activity, coronal mass ejections or solar flares. According to the Space Weather Prediction Center, debris that erupts from the sun in the form of CMEs usually takes around 15 to 18 hours to reach Earth. The bright flashes of solar flares, which can cause radio blackouts, travel at the speed of light to arrive at Earth in just 8 minutes. The Sun may launch a high-speed stream of solar wind into Earth's magnetic field from Thursday, December 1st to Friday, December 2nd. The upcoming storm and is just the latest in a string of solar barrages fired at Earth as the Sun ramps up into the most active phase of its roughly 11-year solar cycle.